Okay, my name is Lucien Ford. I am from Holland, born and raised. I live in Rotterdam. I'm in the beautiful city of Amsterdam for the Amsterdam Dance Event 2008 with my man DJ Disciple in the hizzy. You know what I'm so, saying? So let me ask you something. You've been a part of the Dutch scene for almost about 15 to 20 years, correct? And how, do you, how would you say it's transformed and as far as the development of artists, producers, and DJs? I have to say that in the beginning, we were just more a Dutch-based uh, country based around Dutch music, Dutch DJs, and what I've seen now is that, I mean, like yourself, for instance, you know, we're more interacting with international artists, America, uh, Asia, um, um, you know, former Yugoslavia, for instance. There's so many more people coming up to Holland, and I think it works. You know, you can see that with Fred Legrand, guys like that, where American influence, if you will, is. Answering the and and you, you actually do a radio show that kind of promotes the Dutch dance. Can you tell us about how long you've been involved in the radio station you are? Tell us what the station is, how long you've been involved in the station, and what part you play with it. Well, you know, I've been working for 3FM. 3FM is Dutch National Radio. I've been doing a show that not only broadcasts Dutch music, but I just like to mix it up. Good tunes from inside of Holland, outside of Holland. The thing for me is to get everything on the table. The global dance floor, if you will, might sound cliche, but, you know, there's so many good tunes that people are thinking need to hear. DJs that are having a different insight on the dance scene and that's what I'm trying to do basically, you know. Just okay, and, and, and who, who are some of the DJs that you feel like that's going to be able to globalize, continue to globalize uh, what, what, what the dance music scene is all about? Well, who are some of those DJs that you, you, you refer to? Well, to be honest, you know, yourself, uh, Baggy Begovic, one of my closest mates, you know, he's just really, really playing well. Looking at what Roger Sanchez uh, has done for the scene and is doing, Jesse Garcia, um, Federic Brown, you know, there's so many DJs here in Holland that are actually doing stuff that are inspiring me now. And what's know? some of the events that, that you've been excited about, like, since you've been here? You've been to a couple of events already. Who, who have you seen that has really kind of impressed you, made you stand out? Uh, who's, whose music did you think that you said you took away from it saying, hey, this is something good, fresh, new? Man, I've been to the Tool Room party and Dave Spoon rocked it. It was wicked. Been to, uh, to the Stealth party, Baggy rocked it. Uh, Jesse Garcia rocked it. You know, those are DJs that are really coming up with some new, fresh tunes. And, you know, I get inspired. That's why I come to Amsterdam Dance Event, because I would really like to hear some tunes that I didn't hear before or some edits that I... Uh, must have missed or whatever, you know, get inspired. That's the whole thing, basically. Okay, and uh, and, and what, what's, what's in the plans and the works for, for you, Lucian Ford? What's in the plan for you for 2009? Obviously, we winding down with 2008 with the ADE. What's what's in store? What can people look forward to from Lucian Ford? Well, I keep looking for my tunes. You know, Sound of Law, for instance, got released on RNG recordings with Rogan Greg. It got picked up by Seamus Haji. That went to Big Love. That's going to come. That's going to be a follow-up to that. I uh, signed a record to Hat Candy, uh, Stereo Sushi. That's a little bit more more soulful house with real musicians in there. Uh, I signed something to kick and slip and slide. You know, so many things. Getting back into the studio because I've been doing radio for such a long time. It's going to change. I'm not going to do any radio anymore in 2009 because it's going to be about spinning tunes, producing tunes, and getting out there and making sure that, you know, that we just keep this scene building and growing. And I think that Holland is in the right and good spot to be uh, leading that. Okay. All right. Well, listen, thank you so much, Lucian Ford. You've been such an inspiration to the Dutch scene. Thank and uh, anybody, anything you want to say to any of the fans out there? Man, you know, don't take my word on it. And don't take uh, Disciples' word on it. you got to come see that stuff for yourself, mate. It's like off the chart. Parties all the time. Uh, people are actually, like, having a good sort of, you know, we love partying. We love throwing parties. We love producing tracks. It's a good and healthy ground. If you're creative, you got an idea, come and check it out for yourself.